Our next set of examples dealing with logarithms are the conversion from the logarithmic form to the exponential form. So we're going to go from this form to this form. And to give you a little bit of an example of what we're trying to do here is let's say we have the log to the base 10 of 10,000 and we claim that's equal to 4. The reason why we can say that is because we can take the base and raise it to the fourth power and we should get back what this is equal to 10,000. And so this is what we call the exponential form of this logarithmic form. And so that's how we're going to convert everything. So again, we take the base, raise it to this number to get back to this number right here. So we do the same over here. We take the base, 2, we raise it to this number right here, 6, and that should equal 64, which it does. Over here again, we take the base, 10, we raise it to this number right there, and 10 to the third power should indeed be 1,000. And over here, we take the base and raise it to the minus 2 power. So we raise it to this power right here, and that should equal 1 over 25, which it does because 5 to the minus 2 is the same as 1 over 5 to the second power, and 5 to the second power is 25, so that's 1 over 25. And finally, over here, we take the base, 81, raise it to the 1 fourth power, and that should equal 3. And indeed, that's true. If we take the fourth root of 81, we do indeed get 3. So here you can see how we can convert back and forth between logarithmic form and exponential form.